Hello everyone and welcome to our beautiful English class. Just a reminder before we start, we are in the second intermediate grade. We're in the first semester. English language, of course, our subject. Our lesson today is 2C Exploring the Past Grammar and Lesson. Presented and prepared by Muhammad Falata. Let's start everyone. What we are going to learn today. We're going to practice using the present simple and the past simple to refer to present and past events. It's very, very important, everybody, to know about the present simple and the past simple. Okay? The so warming up, everybody. When did you get your first mobile phone? I'm asking a question about the past. Of course, we used it. When did you get your first mobile phone? Did you remember it? Wow. Uh, I think I got it. Maybe 17 years ago. It was interesting. What about you? How did you call your friends before that? Well, for me, I used to use my telephone. Yeah, use telephone. All beautiful days. Interesting. Okay, how often do you call your friend? Well, I always call my friend almost every day what about you how often do you call your friend okay this is a difference okay as we as we say before s bell he she it we use s with the verb every weekend every weekend okay Bill played tennis last weekend last weekend okay only this date okay this is a big difference guys and that's the difference between the present simple and the past simple so let's take more explanation Okay, I didn't travel a lot in the past. Now I travel every month. Okay, in the past we use I didn't travel a lot in the past. Now I travel every month. Interesting. Okay, I want you to see the difference. Okay. In the present simple, okay, to the past, present, and future refers to habits or actions that happen regularly. Okay, every day, every month, every weekend, okay, happens regularly. Okay, habits. That's the present simple I play football every day I pray in the mosque every day okay this is the present simple to refer to habits or actions that happen regularly what about the past the past simple here is it Refer to action that started, okay, listen carefully, and completed in the past. Started and completed in the past. So, it happened in the past, stayed in the past. As they say, it's past, simple. Past, simple, okay? 
I played football yesterday. Okay? Let's take example. Let's take some examples. Present simple. Ahmed visits Jeddah every holiday. So habits. Okay, every holiday. Bad simple. As we said before, Ahmed never visited. Never visited Jeddah in the past. Talking about something happened in the past. So it's a past simple. Okay, add ed to the verb to this regular verb. Don't forget that. Present simple, the affirmative form means the sentence says yes. I usually, usually, as we said before, adverb of frequency, sleep early every day. The past simple, everybody, okay, it is every day. I slept late last night. Time expression, time expression, time expression. Every day, the present simple, we use the past simple, last night, last week, yesterday, something happened in the past, as we said before, okay? This is the affirmative form, okay? Means the sentence said yes. I slept, yes, I usually sleep early every day. Let's go ahead. The exercise. I usually blank is the verb TV at eight o'clock. Usually adverb of frequency. But yesterday talking about something in the Okay, let's have some exercise. I usually, with the key, everybody, please listen carefully. The keywords that tell you what is it. Okay, let's go to the exercise and see. I usually, usually, talking about something usually happen okay it's the keyword everybody so we use what present simple or past simple watch this is the verb what do you think guys tv at eight o'clock usually at verb of frequency but yesterday talking about what everybody i clean this is the verb my room so I didn't what do you think here and here which tense present simple or the past simple give you a moment I see the answers I usually watch all that verb of frequency we use it in the present simple so watch the same verb okay but yesterday i cleaned i cleaned we add ed because we are talking about the past okay everybody let's go ahead negative negative means the sentence said no present simple how i Turn it to negative. The bus doesn't. Because it it. The bus is it. Okay, everybody? It. He, she, it. We use does. A negative doesn't. Okay. I, the rest, I, we, you, they, we use do and do not. Okay, don't forget that. So the bus doesn't. Is the negative form drive at 10 o'clock the bus doesn't the negative okay say no the bus doesn't arrive at 10 o'clock 
past simple suppose didn't we use all the verb he she it we they you we use didn't okay did did not for the negative did did not okay okay arrive at 10 o'clock yesterday okay it's a past simple okay let's see the exercise okay we have one point and we have exercise about it it's very important to practice so birds black not like milk What do you think? Birds. This does not mean once a negative with the verb. This is a verb. This is a negative. Ahmed. Blank not sleep. Early last night. So the tense is in the what? What do you think, everybody? Okay, let's see the answers. Bears don't, okay? Don't say. Don't like milk. Present simple. Ahmed didn't sleep last night. Last night. The past simple this is the negative. Okay, everybody? Now we are going to the questions. How can we ask in the present simple and how can we ask in the past simple? Let's see. The present simple, when does, as I tell you, the party usually starts. So it, he, and she, we use does, and the rest, we, you, they, and I do. Okay? So when does the party, the party is it, usually, is that verb frequency start okay the past simple when did the party finish when did we use did the party finish when did the party finish okay let's go ahead see some exercise how often black Ali Blank play tennis. Okay, think about it, everybody. How often blank? Often. Don't forget. Ali. Blank. Tennis. A. Blank you blank. Live, in Mecca. This is the verb. This is the verb. Here. In Mecca. B no I blank. The answer of the question. Give you a moment. Let's see the answers. How often does? Often, but verb of frequency as we said before, we use the present simple. Play this is the verb, okay. Blank, did you live in Mecca? Did you live in Mecca? Okay, we use did as we said for all the past simple. And the answer is no, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, I didn't, or yes, I did. Okay, everybody. Complete the sentence below. Use the correct form of the verb in the packets. Okay. Tom, blank, never go to the gym in the past. Tom didn't go to the gym in the past. We are talking about the past. Okay? 
Tom didn't go to the game in the past. But now, I talk about now, every day. Talking about Tom. But what? What do you think, everybody? But he goes, okay? We said he, we add, yes, to the verb. This goes, okay? Just a regular thing. So, now he goes every day. Every day. Let's go ahead. Let's listen, everybody. It's time for listening. Okay, listen to our reporter interviewing an old man, Mr. Smithers, for a TV program and complete the sentences. Okay, we have the sentences. Okay, this is a tip for me. Before you listen, try to predict. Okay, give me what your idea, okay? What kind of information is missing? Okay, let's see. Mr. Smithers is blank, he is old, so talking about what? What do we need? Of course we need the age, okay? The age. Next one. Before he got a TV, Mr. Smithers, blank, and listen to the radio. What do you think? He asked, what's missing here? Before he got the TV, Mr. Smithers, what? And listen to the radio. Before TV. Listen carefully for the information, everybody. I'll see another one. Mr. Smithers bought the TV in. In what? Need you to listen to this information. Okay, everybody? The four. Mr. Smithers bought his first car in. Okay. Good, good. Okay, number five. Before he had a car, Mr. Smithers blanked to work. What's missing here? Before he had a car, Mr. Smithers, how did Mr. Smithers Go to work. Okay? Please listen carefully. We need some specific information. So please take some notes. 4. Listen. Listen to a reporter interviewing an old man, Mr. Smithers, for a TV program and complete the sentences. So, Mr. Smithers, you are 100 years old today. That's quite special. Thank you, young man. Is this interview for a television program? That's right. We didn't have TVs when I was a child. Of course. What did you do for entertainment? I read books. And later I listened to the radio. I really loved the radio. When did you get a TV? My brother bought one in 1948, and we always went to his house to watch TV. As for me, I bought one in 1956. It was very small and black and white, but still it was very exciting. And when did you get your first car? Oh, that was a bit later. They were quite expensive, you see. And I didn't have a lot of money. So was it in the 60s? Yes, in 1963. How did you get around before that? Well, I took the train to work every day. But I also walked a lot. I suppose all that exercise made you healthy and strong, and you lived to a hundred. <laughs> yes, maybe. Okay, everyone, we just listened to the interview. I hope you, to you took some notes. <clears throat> so, let's see. Okay. First information. 
Mr. Smith is. Is blank is old. He is what? How old is Mr. Smithers? He is, of course, one hundred years old. Wow. He is one hundred years old. He's one hundred years old. Okay. Okay, before he got TV, Mr. Smithers blank and listen to the radio what he was doing he was what yes read some books a lot of books Let's go number three mrs. Smithers bought the TV in what do you think Did you write the date 1946 Yes, in 1946, Mr. Smithers bought TV. Okay? Let's go to the. Okay. Number four. Mr. Smithers bought his first car in 19. Everybody, to take some note, 63. Okay, he bought his first car. Last but not least, before he had a car, Mr. Smithers used to what? Used to take, train, or walk to work. Okay? Both. Walk or take some train, but he walked a lot. He walked a lot. Okay? He walked a lot. Okay, good. If you get it right, very, very good. Okay, last but not least, we have this beautiful exercise. The our evaluation about what you took today. Tom, blank never go to the gym in the past. Okay, but now he, this is the verb, this is the verb. Give me your answer. Write it down every day. I'll underline and circle the keywords. To a blank you visit London last year. Last year. So, what dance is it? Yes, my uncles and aunt blank live there, so I visit them often. Okay? Visit them often. Okay. Okay. Tom never went. Because we were talking in the past. Okay, everybody? But now he goes every day. Present simple. Okay? Did you visit? Okay, London last year, the past. Yes, my uncle and aunt live there, so I visit them often okay level frequency let's go ahead jack and i blank play sport after school every day when we were younger but now we only meet on saturday Give me your answers, everybody. I'll give you a moment. Number four, blank. You see Sammy last week. I think he blank a house near you. Near you. Give me your answers. Give you a moment. Okay. Jack and I played sport every day. When we were younger, everybody, this is the key. This is a tricky one, everybody. Every day, when, okay? I'm talking about the past, when we were younger. But now, we only meet on Saturdays. Did you see Sammy last week? Okay? I think he bought a house near you. Okay, this is the question, this is the answer of the 
tuko asen we learn today what we are what okay we learn today what the principle and the past simple the affirmative and negative and question and how do we use it it's very simple use it in your life this is the end of our class thank you very much and see you 